A 3% rise in Hong Kong's Hang Seng Index investors in Asia-Pacific brushed over Wall Street's big losses overnight, with the tech-laden Nasdaq Composite falling almost 4%. In Asia, the Hong Kong market's Hang Seng Index rose 3.24% to end at 24,573.29. After the Bank of England announced its second consecutive rate rise on Thursday, financial stocks in Hong Kong rose on Friday, with HSBC shares rising 4.99% and Standard Chartered rising 4.83%. We believe that interest rates will remain the dominating issue in the first half of this year, at least, Kieran Calder, head of equities research for Asia at UBP said on Friday. Because of variables such as increased net interest income and rates, financials are expected to be the primary beneficiary of this trend, he noted. On Friday, Hong Kong's financial markets reopened after being shut down for the Lunar New Year holidays. The markets on China's mainland are closed on Friday in observance of the holiday. The Kospi index in South Korea rose 1.57% to 2,750.26. Nikkei 225 in Japan rebounded from early losses to close 0.73% higher at 27,439.99 and the Topix index rose 0.55% to 1,930.56, respectively. Australia's S&P ASX 200 index rose 0.6% to 7,120.20 on the day. One and a half percentage points were added to the broadest MSCI index of Asia-Pacific equities outside Japan. The Nasdaq Composite, a tech-heavy index, plummeted 3.74% overnight to 13,878.82, its lowest close since September 2020. Both the S&P 500 and the Dow Jones Industrial Average were down by more than a percent, with the S&P falling 2.44% to 4,477.44 and the Dow down 1.45%, respectively.